You'll never guess who's awake. You're shitting me. Come see for yourself. How long has it been? Years. I stopped keeping track a while ago. I can't believe it's been that long. Time flies when you're watching someone breathe through a tube. How's the family? My wife's cheating on me with an altar exec, and uh, my daughter sits in her room listening to Aisha albums all day. Oh, for a dead woman, she sure releases a lot of records. <laughs> no shit. God, that was a hell of a year. Alderman Hughes, Mayor Winslow, Aisha, Chief Monroe. All murdered by that asshole who's been sitting in intensive care on taxpayers' money. Well, he said he wouldn't pull the plug. Lord knows why. Anyone call the chief? Couldn't get through. The press has been mobbing him with phone calls. Oh, about the... Yep. I forgot that was today. You should pay more attention. Fuck off. How's the patient? Seeing as they're still breathing after being caught in a massive explosion, I'd say pretty good. Coming through! What happened? Shanking. Put him over there. Sorry about that. Have they said anything yet? Not yet. But I'm about to take the bandages off. You really think I'm a- These gangs have no idea who they're dealing with. Keep it real, man. These gangs have no idea who they're dealing with. You know who I am? Yes. That looks like it healed nicely. Be careful, doctor. Your patient's dangerous. You got anything you want to say to the judge, you better start thinking of it now. You're wasting your time. Let's get a hold of Troy. Psst. Hey! Is it really you? Do I know you? My brother was in the Saints and he told me all about you. Listen, we gotta get you out of here. Well, I'm sure if we ask nicely. I know a way out. Yeah? Then why are you still here? I heard you were in here and I wanted to bust you out. Getting out of here is a two-man job and no one else will give it a try. You really expect me to trust some guy I don't even know? Come on, I just got myself shanked so I could get a chance to talk to you. Doesn't that show I'm loyal? It shows that you're dumb enough to let yourself get stabbed. I'm trying to help you. You know what I got the last time I trusted someone? Blowing the fuck up. You need me. The hell I do, I got the sights. <laughs> sure you do. What's that supposed to mean? How long do you think you've been out? Oh, I don't know, mate. Two to three weeks. Look, I know you think you're a badass, but do you even know where you're at? Without me, you'll be wandering around the prison for hours. Even if you manage to hide from the guards that long, and if you actually figure out how to make it outside these walls, you're just gonna find out that you're sitting on a goddamn island. And I'm pretty sure you can't outswim the Coast Guard. You got a boat stashed here? No, but I know where we're gonna steal one. All right, let's get out of here.
Let me show you. No one walks away. Understand. Who else wants a piece, eh? We can either try to sneak out through the roof or charge out the front. You're caught. Can't believe I'm breaking out of jail with you. Just stay focused, little man. Time to get on. Jesus! Are you crazy? Oh! Follow me. I know the way out. Okay, we gotta climb these pipes up to the roof. So, do you remember my brother? I'm not gonna lie. Got no idea who the hell you're talking about. So, what are you gonna do when you get out of here? I ain't worrying about that until I'm out of here. Such a bad idea after all, huh? I think we might pull this off. You telling me you didn't know this was gonna work? Start celebrating till we're off this damn island. I'm gonna get us out of here!
Check those cops out! That's a row. It is now. Jesus, when did this happen? <laughs> when Ulter got involved. The cloud ain't coming. After Hughes was killed in that bombing of yours, Ulter picked up the pieces. Now they're everywhere. On TV, on billboards, in stores. Hell, if you ever forget who Ulter is, just look towards Saints Row and you'll see that fucking eyesore. Here we are. We're gonna find the other Saints. <laughs> what other Saints? What you talking about? Without anyone to lead them, the Saints fell apart. Once the Brotherhood, Ronan and Samdi showed up, the few that were left dropped their flags before they got killed. Oh, that's fucking great. Look, I know you didn't ask for it, but my advice is to just keep your head down. The cops are looking for you and a lot's changed. I say you just go buy a beer and soak up as much information as you can. Thanks, Carlos. Anytime. Make sure to listen for our sale ads on the radio. That's exactly what I would have recommended. Thanks for buying that. I was getting tired of looking at it.
try that if you didn't. attempt against then decorated police officer Troy Bradshaw. In the resulting trial, Gat was convicted of one count of attempted murder and a staggering 387 counts of first degree murder, promptly sending him to death row. Hey Barry, turn this shit off! Yeah, I was watching that. I guess you're not anymore, are you, bitch? Could you turn the TV back? In a few short moments, we'll be allowed back in the courtroom and we'll find out, once and for all, if Mr. Gat will go home a happy man or a dead one. Back to you, Jack. Oh, shit. That hurt! Oh. 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 I was hoping you'd be the no. hitting cry. I'll only laugh a little bit. Ah. Baby, I'm just warming up. You give me any more I'm not gonna This ain't happening. What the hell are you going on here? I ain't be a stain on the pavement when I finish. Think of your baby. When are you saints gonna learn? Mr. Gat, you've been convicted of over 300 murders. Do you really expect this appeal to work? I figure with the statute of limitations, it really should be closer to 250. There's no statute of limitations for murder! Why the fuck not? 
Watch yourself, Mr. Gat. Or what? You hold me in contempt of court? You're already planning on giving me the chair. You think I'd give a shit about you not liking me? Fuck off. I'm curious if you can keep your cavalier attitude when 2,000 volts are running through your body. Oh yeah? And I'm curious if you can keep acting like a douchebag when I shove that gavel up your ass. My client would like that stricken from the record. What's that? Drop it. Uh, anyone hit and need a lawyer? Shit. About time your burnt ass woke up. You are okay, Johnny? Yeah, aside from almost getting sent to the chair, I'm fucking great. Hey, you look different. You do something with your hair? You ready to get out of here? to me out. Ish would have killed me if I got executed. You still with Aisha? Yeah, I mean, got a little tricky with me on death row and her being on the DL after faking her own death. But, you know, we found a way to make it work. How long were you in jail, anyway? Two years and 31 days. Not like you were counting. Yeah, right? You know, it's weird. People inside were betting how long I'd last. See, when I was first busted, guards were always trying to put me in the ground. After Troy became chief of police, it all stopped. Troy must be more forgiving than I am. Troy's the chief of police. Yo, you better start getting with the times. Julius is missing. Ben King wrote an autobiography. Dex is a... Yo, know, don't even get me started with Dex. But the real kicker is Troy. In a couple of months, he went from undercover cop to, to chief of police. And word is, he's become obsessed with finding out what happened on your little boat trip with the Alderman. If I get some free time, I might swing by the station and say hello.
Thank you so much for coming in on short notice. You are a lifesaver. I'm still a little confused why I got a call from a casting director's assistant. Right. So, here's the thing. After, like, two years of doing laundry for my boss, he finally allowed me to cast tonight's episode of Fuzz. Still confused. Right. Well, the officer that agreed to let us film them ended up getting sent to the hospital, so I kind of need a last-minute replacement. I saw your mugshot on the news, and you're a perfect match. So you want me to pretend to be a cop on national TV? All you have to do is drive around and give us some good footage. Like good footage making arrests, or good footage knock a shirtless guy into a kiddie pool? Miranda doesn't make for good TV. Yeah, I can help. It's time for... ...for some vulgar abuse of power! <laughs> Arrow is on the power, please respond. Oh, uh, take this sledgehammer. Hey, uh, can you kick him a little more? Women like you, that ruined my life. This is a free country. I can love it. Rabbit. You want my gun to accidentally go off? Decency is being assaulted. We need an officer on the scene immediately. My camera was pointing the wrong way. Can, can you go back and do that again? You think we can get them to sign a waiver? Are you, are you sure cops are allowed to do that? Is that legal? Don't worry, we can edit that out in post. Oh, Expressing love is a natural thing, man. This is gonna get us an award. Don't! Oh. I have never seen police work like this! Ah. This just doesn't feel right! This is like an invasion of privacy! Oof. My producer is going to shave his pants. A streaker has just been called in. Please respond. again someday. Are you sure that's it? Yeah, another episode of Fuzz in the Can.
Come on in. You want a beer? Yeah, that'd be great. Johnny, who's that? Yo, come to the living room and find out. Johnny, I don't care if you just broke out of jail. You do not mess with my furniture. Oh my god, it's you. Surprise, Aisha. What? That you're here, or that you're talking? Pick one. We all thought you were dead. I almost was. Well, for someone who was blown to hell, you look great. <laughs> Did you do something with your hair? Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Yo, can we get back to business? What's the rush? I've been cooped up on death row and that bitch has been laid out in a coma. Hmm. We definitely need to remind motherfuckers who we are. And that can't wait until after dinner? No. <laughs> you two haven't changed at all. Well, you know, there's a saying about dogs and blowing shit up. <laughs> so what's the plan? We get our crew together. Once we got that, we can work on how we're taking back our city. Sounds good. And where were you planning on having this little meeting? No. Well, this place is pretty spacious. No. The color's very soothing. No. Come on, Ish. This ain't no fucking gang clubhouse. Change of plans. We gotta find a new place. Yeah, you got it. Head over to the old mission house. We should be able to set up shop there. Why don't we just set up shop at the church? Altor's renovated it and turned it into a tourist trap. You're kidding me. I wish I was. We gotta find a new place and the mission house will be perfect. Religious buildings are kinda been there, done there. Now we're not staying in the mission. Now check it out. Years ago, an earthquake dropped part of the city below sea level. And rather than clearing out the rubble, the city just built over it. There's an abandoned hotel below the mission that'll work for us. Alright, what's the catch? We gotta evict the current tenants. Sounds like fun.
Well, savor the minty taste of doom. No prisoner. Oh, oh God. On you. Oh. Oh. This is our city. That's So, what you think? It's kind of a shithole. True that. But it's a shithole with potential. I don't know, mate. Oh, come on. A stripper pole, some flat screens, maybe some nicer furniture? You have me a stripper pole. Fucking A.
Thank God you're here. Every second we're talking is one more second of airtime that Zack Johnson is stealing from me. Who? Oh? You know, that nut job lawyer who gets hard at the idea of a lawsuit. Lately he's been crusading against media he deems to be offensive. Does he have a lot of support? Not really. But the guy makes a big enough ass out of himself that whenever he pulls some stunt, people listen. And if people are watching him, they're not watching me. So what do you want me to do? Get out there and give me something worth covering. The more damage you do, the longer I can do a live broadcast. Get far because of this, I'll kick your ass.
You know, this ain't exactly what I had in mind for my day. Oh, we gotta clean this place out. Yo, I'm not a fucking janitor. No shit, you're a goddamn diva. Come on, this is the kind of shit people who just got canonized should have to do. Good idea. We'll just ask some of the crew for help. Hey, buddy, wanna help? No? Looks like we're doing this ourselves. That's my point. We can't really run a gang if we don't have, you know, a fucking gang. You said it yourself. Most of the old crew are either dead or busted by Troy. We're gonna have to start fresh. Yeah, well, let's get on that, because I'm done mopping up blood. This kid Carlos helped me bust out. Seems all right, but we're gonna need more. What you thinking? You, I met some people in jail who might work. Let me make some calls. Once I find out where these bitches are, you're gonna have to show them that you're the real deal, though. They won't just follow anybody. It won't be a problem. Hey, before you go, what sort of crew are you looking for? Why is Troy still going easy on me? I'd love to help the saints, but first you need to do me a favor. A deadbeat friend of mine owes me money. Can you help me repossess his car? How you been? Busy. Yeah, I heard what you did at Johnny's trial. Oh, I couldn't let my boy fry. You know a guy from jail? You know I saw Johnny in prison once. He didn't look like a really happy guy. Oh, he's happy enough when he's killing somebody. <laughs> nah, seriously, no, he's a good guy. Just don't piss him off. Ramon, what's up? Listen, I don't got a lot of time. I was just calling to let you know that <laughs> I stole your car. Are you there? Great. Here's the deal. If you don't want your car cubed, I really suggest you pay me what you owe me. Talk to you later, Ramon.
Yeah, you're in, Carlos. I'll meet you at the old mission. Run with you, I want to see you fuck some Ronin up. Definitely down for being with your crew. Good. Meet me at the abandoned mission house. I'll be there. I'm Shandi. What do you say you show me what you can do in that thing? Doesn't have a scratch. It's not a real fight. Now the this is I a shed. A transmission. Oh! Would you say we go and meet the rest of the boys, Shondi? Good times. Let's go. What the hell is going on? I had to do some canonizing. Hold up. 
You, you're next. Wait, what? Sorry about that. Where did you find these guys? Like I said, I made some calls. You guys actually hang out down here? I don't know. Add a flat screen, some throw pillows, and a hookah, and this place would be all right. You definitely need a stripper pole in this bitch. Definitely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So what do we do now? We listen. All right, everybody listen up. We got some serious shit to discuss. A saint's used to own Stillwater. And it seems like the only motherfuckers that remember that is me and Gat. I think it's time we give those other crews a wake-up call. Now, I ain't gonna lie, a lot of shit's changed since I went out of the game. So I'm gonna need some help. Pierce, you're on the Ronin. I wanna know who's calling the shots and what businesses they're running. Done. Shondi, you got the sons of Sandy. It's gotta be them. Fuck, you say? It, it's cool. I, I got this. Carlos. The Brotherhood. I'm on it. Alright. Once we're done here, talk to one of these guys. They'll have something for you to do. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. Yeah!